The HubSpot email extension for Outlook puts a light version of your HubSpot portal in your Outlook inbox. This video will show you how to manage your log and track settings and also show you some of the features and benefits that are now available to you once you download and install this email extension. Check it out. Once you have downloaded and installed the Outlook extension for HubSpot, you'll notice that now you have access to the sales tool right within your Outlook inbox. Clicking on that, you'll notice that any information about the contact, if they are already in your CRM, you'll be able to access this information here. Now, if you'd like to go directly to your HubSpot CRM, simply click Open in CRM. But all the way down at the bottom at any one of these, you want to go to the Add In Settings. And by clicking that, the first thing you want to do is you want to adjust so that you're able to manage your log and track settings. So these two buttons by default will be on. And so what you want to do in order to accurately manage your log and track settings, you're going to want to turn these off. If you leave them on, HubSpot will log and track every single email that you send. And so what ends up happening is if you use your work email to set up appointments with your dentist, for example, HubSpot, if they don't recognize the email, they will create a contact for your dentist. And if that's not necessary for your business HubSpot portal, then certainly you're going to want to make sure that you manage your log and track settings. Now, in addition to this, you can also put your dentist's email right here and it will never be logged in your HubSpot portal. Now, a lot of organizations also put their organization domain name here so that every email that is sent internally will not get logged and tracked within HubSpot. Once you have adjusted these default settings, you can simply go back to your contact. Now, when you're composing an email and you click on this button, it's changed a little bit. I'm going to send this to Rob again. And when you click on this, you'll notice that Rob's information comes up down here, his activity. You can also adjust your settings down at the bottom. But now you also have these email message tools. And so if you have set up in your HubSpot portal any templates, any sequences, if you've uploaded any documents or created any meeting links, or if you've created any snippets, these will all be available to you now right inside your Outlook inbox. I can also manage my log and track settings right here within the message tools. And so let's say I want to track this email. I simply click this box right here. This is an example of how at Pittsburgh Internet Consulting, we have put our domain name within the never log setting. And so this email cannot be logged to our HubSpot CRM because all of our team members have been placed on the never log list through the domain name. And so once you have this set up, you'll be able to easily manage your log and track settings as well as utilize the HubSpot extension within your Outlook inbox.